the Logitech G930 gaming wireless headset. Where could this headset go wrong? Well, it really doesn't. With its nice design, made out of plastic, but hey, it's a headset. And it's nice it's, um, tactile G keys and a volume uh, rocker. My high quality microphone with unique features and a little standardized micro USB charging port. So that's just the same one that all your Android devices use. Yeah. Um, other than that, of course, this headset is 7.1 surround sound virtual, might I add. So that, what that means is it uses a little receiver. This is a little receiving dock um, that coils up and that just plugs in by USB. This headset's range is pretty incredible. I'm on a two-story house right now and if I go downstairs and walk over to the other side of the um, house, going through walls Sometimes it still doesn't cut out. If you wait a few seconds, it usually finds itself again. So, yeah, this headset really is great. If you're in uh, the market for uh, probably around $150 headset, that's nice and wireless, and not too heavy, might I add. Like, it's not heavy at all. It's a standard. It is. It does get a type. It you, it does take a little bit of getting used to, but other than that, it's a great headset. So, turn it around, nice padding, leather-ish, I guess, and red on the inside, little LED to indicate that the microphone is off, and nice little leather padding on here as well, and up there it just says G930. My only complaints about this headset would be, I can't think of any actually, battery life lasts around 10 hours, so battery is good, I only find myself having to plug it in every two days or so, I don't know, it, de it depends on what you're doing, like I actually I haven't talked about this yet, on here you have your power button, so you hold that in for a few seconds to turn it off, and here is your um, Dolby 7.1 and stereo headset rocker. Up is when it's in stereo, so it's only using two speakers, I'm pretty sure. And that is when it's in surround sound virtual. So this does not have full real 7.1 surround sound. If you want a real um, surround sound, go get a Razer. Tiamat, or whatever it's called. 7.1, what they mean by that is it's using all six or so of these little coloured things here. These two are from my keyboard. It's not using this for the headset. Other than that, let's take a look at the software for a quick second. Sorry. Turn my flash off. So you have the software here. So you have your software here. You can go in and customize what these buttons do. So right now I have it on uh, play, pause, and previous and next. Um, yeah, you can change it to individual keys. So yeah. Um, you have your own levels. So if you know about changing the bass and the tremble, the volume and the microphone like level, um, you can has a little inbuilt. Um, sort of focus. 
right, it's not going to fix it. I'll do, I might do a separate video on this. Yeah, that'll be good. This here is just showing um, all the levels of your 7.1 speakers. So you can turn, if you're hearing stuff on the left a bit too loud, you can turn it down, etc. And here is your voice changer. So you can do a voice preview and hear what your voice sounds like. And you just click on one of these, like you've got a troll and an alien, and you sound all funky. And yeah, so about three, yeah, about nine hours remaining of battery. I've had that on. It wasn't even fully charged when I took it off. So yeah, thank you guys for watching my little quick review of the Logitech G930 gaming headset. Once again, I got this from Umart for $140. Yes, this is Australian. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.